Reliable data on factors like student and teacher attendance or school infrastructure are necessary for making well-informed decisions in education management. How can DHIS2 facilitate the efficient and systematic collection of education data? The Gambia uses DHIS2 to manage various administration functions of the education system by establishing essential indicators, such as enrollment by grade, absenteeism rates for students and teachers, or gender parity by type of school. They also configured indicators for school infrastructure, such as number of classrooms, number of recreational facilities, and number of textbooks by subject. How did they do it? They tackled two major tasks, designing and implementing digital tools for data collection and data analysis. First, they switched from a paper-based annual school census form to a digital form in DHIS2 to collect yearly aggregate data on number of classes, number of students enrolled by grade broken down by age and gender, number of classrooms, general facilities, water resources, and number of textbooks. They also created a data entry form in DHIS2 to collect daily school attendance twice a day based on the number of students present in the morning and afternoon shifts. To analyze the data collected, they created analysis tools, including various dashboards with visualizations, such as attendance or absenteeism rates. What were the results? These dashboards enabled educational planners to easily visualize both yearly education data, such as infrastructure needs, and daily data on attendance in order to evaluate patterns, inform planning decisions, and address immediate challenges. While this aggregate data was helpful, over time, the Gambia's education authorities realized they needed to keep track of each individual student's progress. How did they do it? They developed tools for collecting data from both students and educators using Tracker. These tools gave them more detailed information about individual students and teachers that could be monitored over time. For instance, they could keep track of students' grades and progress as they went through their education from year to year. With the help of DHIS2, the Gambia was able to make informed decisions regarding the management of schools, infrastructure, and resources to improve learning outcomes. In summary, this use case shows that DHIS2 supports data collection, reporting, and analysis in different sectors, including education, and how it is an adaptable platform that adjusts to changing requirements over time.